if you are facing problem with your windows updates and every time you try to install windows after restarting your computer uh, it shows some uh, messages uh, uh, windows updates runs for few percent and after that uh, and with undoing changes made to your computer or any other some uh, windows update issues so this is the easy solution uh, for you we will be deleting few folders this is a simple solution uh, for example in windows we will be deleting this software distribution folder uh, this is the folder where updates are downloaded and another in uh, system 32 cat root 2 i repeat it is cat root 2 that we will be deleting but the problem is that it is not deleted automatically so easily so we have to stop few services in order to uh, delete these two folders so what we have to do uh, for that in windows and security we will go to uh, recovery option here it is the recovery option and uh, under advanced startup click restart now uh, click this button we will be rebooting the computer uh, from here in safe mode safe mode itself removes a lot of hurdles so what we'll be doing go to advanced option and uh, uh, startup settings uh, from startup setting it shows you uh, the option here it is uh, the fourth option the enable safe mode so we'll be doing this one so uh, let's restart uh, we'll click on restart button and after restart uh, it gives option uh, several choices and we'll be using the fourth one so we'll uh, use f4 function key for that as suggested and uh, we'll be booting in safe mode so uh, here you see that uh, the software is uh, windows in a safe mode here it is a symbol of safe mode so now let's go to windows and uh, let's delete software distribution folder it will be deleted now so let's delete uh, software distribution folder and uh, it is now deleted you can see now let's go to windows uh, system 32 and uh, let's try to delete cat root but it will not because it is still with uh, cryptographic services so let's stop the cryptography services for that we'll go to start and we'll open the powershell uh, as administrator so uh, here windows powershell and under powershell uh, let's uh, right click on it and uh, right click go to more and here you will see uh, run as administrator we'll need administrator permission that's why so now we are in the command uh, powershell command mode a cd is to go back we will be going to the windows and system 32 folder so this is the command uh, cd windows and after that uh, enter and uh, now cd system 32 now we are in system 32 folder now uh, let's stop the crypto service cryptographic service that is engaging the uh, cat root folder so command it is net stop and the cryptographic service is known as C R Y P T S V C. So it is crypt S V C and uh, enter. Now it is stopping the cryptographic service and you can see that it has been stopped. Now rename cat root folder R E N cat root 2 and uh, we are giving the new name cat root 2 dot old. So uh, if you see uh, in explorer, uh, folder explorer windows, uh, this folder has already been renamed to catroot2.old. So now it is in no use in service. So let's delete it. So if you see in recycle bin, both the folders are there. So uh, these folders have been successfully deleted now. After that, uh, just exit the command and restart. And after that, when you will be uh, running the updates again, update should uh, work normally without any issues so uh, the windows is restarted now and go to uh, all settings and uh, after all settings go to windows and security update check for updates here and uh, uh, this should solve all the problems and i assume that after restarting most of the problems should be solved now